Houthi rebels have claimed one of their most significant strikes since they started mounting attacks at the ships in the Red Sea. The Iran ring levels have targeted two U.S. ships in the Gulf of Aden. They claim the hits were accurate. <laughs> With the help of God Almighty, the naval forces of the Yemeni armed forces carried out two qualitative military operations in which they targeted two American ships in the Gulf of Aden. The first was Sea Champion and the other was the Navis Fortuna. The targeting was carried out with a number of appropriate naval missiles and the hits were accurate and direct, thanks to God. According to the rebel group, in one of the attacks, missiles damaged a Belize flagship, forcing the crew to abandon the vessel. The vessel was said to be traveling through the Bab al Mandab Strait that connects the Red Sea to the Gulf of Aden, while another ship reportedly came under attack twice in the Gulf of Aden. This recent attack carried out by the rebel group has brought the total number of attacks to four in the last 24 hours alone, including one targeting a British ship, which resulted in its a complete sinking and one targeting a U.S. MQ-9 drone near the Red Sea port city of Hodeida. Although, according to reports, the Pentagon is still investigating the cause of a crashed American military surveillance drone off the coast of Yemen. Meanwhile, the United States military says that it's conducting new airstrikes targeting the rebels, including one that targeted the first Houthi underwater drone seen since the rebels began launching attacks on international shipping routes in November. Amidst the ongoing crisis in the Red Sea, Egypt's president, Abdel Fattah al-Sisi, says that the Suez Canal, which used to earn about $10 billion a year, has seen its revenues drop by 40 to 50 percent. The canal is one of the main sources of foreign currency for Egypt, which is gripped by a severe financial crisis. For all the latest news, download the WeOn app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.